All right, next up, oh gosh, I'm I'm telling you, I'm grasping at straws in this randomizer right now. I usually hit, like, some sort of a wall like this. And each one that I've done, uh, it's just, this one's, this one's especially intimidating and scary because I'm pretty sure there's only, like, a small handful of checks left. So, I mean, that should tell us one thing, at least. Like, we're going to find something, right? I mean, that's my hope. That is my hope. But, um, I want to check out the frogs first. I was reminded of this spot specifically uh, by Quinn G. Yeah, shout out. Especially if this is something good, then you just came in some, you just came in clutch. Let's just, let's, let's, let's check it out. I'm pretty sure I need to do two songs here. Oh, maybe just the one. Um, song of Time. Oh, please be something good, please. All that's left is Epona and Sun Song, right? Please... Oh, yes! Rudo's letter! Oh, man! Okay. Okay! I said this earlier. Why is the bottle sideways? Is it usually sideways? I don't, why am I worrying about that? This this is huge. This is huge! That was probably on maybe, maybe number one or number two. Like, uh, the top things that I wanted to get ASAP. <laughs> oh, man. Quinn G. Ah, oh, you came in clutch for sure. That's huge. That is that is awesome. Oh, it's about dang time. I had let's see, let me let me just look here. I had I've written down one, two, three, like Hail Mary, huge just like go big or go home things I was gonna do. And hope something came from it. But we don't have to do that right now. I mean, there's still things. It's not like guaranteed checks. There were things I was just going to double check to make sure I did. The frogs was one of them. Like, I I wasn't certain. I don't, yeah, I, I knew for sure that I didn't do Song of Time. But I was curious about Soraya's song. Um, and there was like, I think a bean patch in the Lost Woods I wanted to double check. But I'm, I'm just, oh man, that's so awesome. I'm so glad we found that. Again, huge shout out to... Uh, the uh, the master and commander of that check right there, Quinn G. Amazing. Amazing! See, this is why... Oh, and there's a beehive up there. That's right. Oh, yes. It's up there. You see it up there? It's not wiggling, though. Anyway, we'll check it out. Right after this oo-weep. We, we're back right after this oo-weep. Right after these messages. Now you best believe it's a letter from your kid. It's about dang time, too. That was one quick ooeep. Thank you so much. I'm so freaking psyched up right now. This is amazing. Oh, don't, don't, don't botch it. Okay. Yeah, it's wiggling now. Maybe it, like, maybe the wiggles are saved from... Oh, shoot, I, I forgot. We can't do it with the slingshot. What can I do it with? I've got bombs. I can time it just right. I can't do it with dense fire. Here we go. Ready? No. I've got to, got to hit it with the boomerang. That's so weird. The slingshot doesn't do it. I thought it did. That's so weird. Just oddly enough, just bombs. And the boomerang and the hook shot, right? We'll come back for that with the hook shot, though. I'm gonna get a oh, we gotta get a dang fish. Um, but this is nice because we'll be able to do a couple things just from this area, and then also, of course, we'll see what Jabu Jabu's belly is, and the ice cavern over there as an adult. This is huge. This is this is great. This is exactly exactly what I needed. 
Let's head this way, though. There's a fairy, a great fairy over here, right? I know there's a skull chill up. Maybe it has to be nighttime for this. Yeah. Oh, nope, it doesn't. Okay. Uh, just a little heart. A measly heart. I don't I don't even care anymore. I'm feeling so good right now. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. So um there's another sculpture around here. I have to climb this log for it. But is that one at night? I'll just double check. But I have to climb up this log, and maybe that's as an adult? Uh, I don't know. I'm I'm not incredibly familiar with these checks, like the timing of things. But it's fine. Yeah, this one might be at nighttime. So I'll check that, but I'll check that later. At the very least, I'll be able to come back as an adult as well and, and see, so it's fine. But let's, uh, let's go grab a fish and check out what is inside the great Jabu of Jabu's bellies. Gosh, I really want to get, I really, really want to get this guy right here. But I can't. We Kermit Fear fishy fishy Fear fishy fishy Oh I guess I have an empty bottle in my hands right now as we speak. I remember as a kid playing Ocarina of Time. I remember this was this was the most confusing part. I don't I don't know why. I don't know why, but I had no idea that I had to feed Jabu a fish. So whenever I got to this part of the game, I was kind of frustrated. I was like, I don't know what to do! I don't know what to do next. This was back in the day when, like, you needed to have, like, a guide, like, an actual guidebook. Or, I don't know, know how to read. Because I'm pretty sure it mentions, like, feeding Jabu Jabu. And, like, that's what Princess Rudo did, right? Or something like that. I know it mentions it in the game, so you got to draw the conclusion a little bit. But when I was a kid, I just had no idea what to do. I got to this point, like, the Dango's Cavern gave me all the confidence in the world. Because it's pretty easy. Debatably the easiest dungeon um, probably tied with Deku Tree. I mean, I know Deku Tree is more of like a tutorial kind of dungeon, sort of. So it doesn't really... I don't know, it, it's definitely on the easier side, but killing Dodongo, uh, the Dodongo King is so much easier than killing Goma. And they're both easy, so that tells you how easy it truly is. Then Jabu Jabu is like a huge step up. Nice! We can do this whole thing right now. The great... The Great Deku Tree. Speaking of the Great Deku Tree, here we are. What chests are you going to give us, huh? Are they going to be good? No, just a refill right here. Oh my gosh, I'm getting all this. I'm getting all these rupees in these refill chests. I kind of wished I had a bigger wallet. But it's probably fine. Actually, let's let's uh go through here foist. Oh, duh! I gotta use my shield. Oh no! Do I seriously not have? Oh, I do have a Deku shield shield still. I know I <laughs> I know I accidentally burned it that one time. Don't remind me. Let's just not talk about that. That was that was an embarrassing chapter of my life. But it's funny. It's kind of a recurring chapter of my life. It happens multiple times. It's never just a one-time thing. I know. I get it. I know what. I know how to move, little dummy. <laughs> You'll probably notice that there's a lot more pep in my step and in my voice because I am really, really happy that we found something worthy of our time. And it allows us to complete this freaking dungeon as a, as a kid. And then, wait, this isn't the room where it's at, right? Oh, it is up there. I was going to say, I, I've missed that before. This, it's a fun song as well. Gabora Gabora, you know? It's like a, it's like a, a wise, mysterious... Oh, come on. We don't need these anymore. So the, the crazy thing is, is yes. Yes, of course. I could have come here... A long time ago, I had the Song of Time for quite a while, like a good 
a good minute, a good long minute. But, alas, I just totally forgot about the dumb frogs. It's alright, we found other things in the meantime, right? It's still been good. Things have been fine. It's not just, not just, it's like, it's not until, you know, just recently where we've actually needed something. Ooh, okay, alright. I don't know why I have so many close calls with those wall sculpture things. But I do. Come on down. You imagine, like, out of all the Zelda enemies, honestly, one of the creepiest ones in real life would be a, a Skulltula. There's massive, massive spiders that their backs look like a skull. Like, it's... They're pretty terrifying, you know? Why did I waste my time killing that one? I just... I don't care. I don't care. Okay, okay. Okay, now let's... There's three checks in here. But it looks like they're refill chests. The other one might have been a sculptural chest, but... Yeah. Okay, thank you for the stick. Thank you so much. What is it up there? It's definitely not a good chest. Honestly, we found... We found a ton of good stuff. We only have just a small handful. Speaking of... Oh, I know I should jump, but I just wanted to do that. Okay. Woo! Okay. Get this little refill, get it out of the way. I mean, I'd be okay with, like, bombs or bomb chews or something right now. Or nuts. Okay, whatever. Oh my gosh. We're... If we had, like, a bottomless wallet, we'd be so dang rich. Come on. Come on, little guy. Come on, big guy. Okay, now let's jump down here. Oh, that's a little too far to the right. Or a little too far back. Oh my gosh, shut up. Hey, 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 hey. All right. Let's not mess this up now. Oh, okay, gosh, I was going to say, are you kidding me? I did it again. Whoa, chill out, Link. Chill the crap out, man. Sculptula chest. Oh, come on. Like, I I don't know. I, I'd take, like, a long shot or something. For a key ring. For Roar's Wind. This is warp magic that you can use. It's kind of like a... Like a boring description. <laughs> this is warp magic that you can use. What, I was... What, did you think I was under the impression that we couldn't use it? That it was just like a little decoration or something? Well, it would be really nice if I could find just a Kokiri sword. I mean, I've already come this far without it, so... I guess it's really not that big of a deal at this point, but... All right, we now need to kill this fella right here. More sticks. Isn't there a Deku stick upgrade that allows us to carry more? Got a stick. Or is that not in Ocarina of Time? No, I'm pretty sure that is, because I'm the tracker, right? Yeah, 20. Oh. You can carry up to 30. Yeah. Have we found one? Maybe we've found one already. And I... What the? Thank you. 
Ooh. Twenty-three is number one. Oh my gosh, I keep I keep forgetting those dudes. Need the shield. I get it. I got ya. Where's the switch? Where oh it's over here, that's right. What, what in the world? What in the world do you need? Whoops, whoops! You know what? Just, just chuck a bomb. Get it over with. That's what I should have been doing this whole time. the bomb. There you go. Gently gently set the bomb down. Oh, oh my gosh. Okay. <laughs> oh, it's so funny. This game. Can I put the stick away, please? Thank you. Whee! Oh, nice. And let's do that. Nope, come on. That hit it. Thank you. Thank you, and... Okay. Thank you. No, not you. Over here. With this, oh shoot, don't we need the, don't we need the, uh, the boomerang in here? Because we can't climb this, can we? Dang it, well we'll be able to see what it is, at least. A map, okay. Okay, yeah, don't care about that. We will leave that alone. Oh great. Little spideys. Little baby gomas. This part as a kid always terrified me too. I could just book it. Book it over here and I know there's a glitch or a secret or something to, to jump up here early. I can't remember how to do it. I remember I've, I've watched somebody do it before. Do I really only have one Deku Seed left in my slingshot? I guess I could have used Din's Fire, but maybe save myself a stick. Oh, come on. What? Come on. Bringing out the big guns. Okay, here we go. <laughs> oh, this is great. This is great. I don't think we know either if... Wait, is this a medallion of sorts? Oh! <gasps> Yes, it's the water medallion. Great, 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 great. All right, 23. It's numero. Oops, let's go back. 23 is number one. 
How did you figure out our secret? Well, you have a rat. You have a rat amongst you. Somebody ratted you guys out. I spared his life. I have one Deku Seed, but that's fine. I wish I could pull off the infinite sword glitch thing with a Deku stick. I know there's... I know you can, right? I'm pretty sure you can do it. I just don't really know how. I know how to do it with the sword. Maybe one of these days I'll, uh, I'll figure out how to do it. That, the, the boss music is... Uh, um, Kekrigo Village. Oh, dang it. A horrible shot. That's ah, alright. I'll take care of him like this. And we're good. Boom, and kabloom, and... Oh, dang it. Where are you? Where are you? This music really makes this this whole boss fight just like a little. It feels like it feels like nothing, not intimidating, not scary. Like Goma, you need to figure things out. You take three jump slashes to die. Dodongo just takes two. I get it though. For like beginner players that haven't played this before, it's like you know they didn't want to make Dodongo King maybe that difficult like that quick to kill because I don't know it's kind of a process to beat him you have to throw a bomb in his mouth and you have to figure out to do that in the first place Ugh, just a stick it's all right hey we completed a dungeon that was fun that was good <laughs> we did all the checks in this except that one I mean we just we know it's a map so it's fine that's Skulltula um so yeah dang there we go wow I did not think did not think that I would be completing a dungeon as soon as I uh you know, as soon as I went along with this little checklist. With, again, that first one not being for me. Quinn G came in clutch. The Deku Tree was brought to you by Quinn G. And then uh, we'll come back here for the Ice Cavern. Why don't we just do that right now? Let's go become an adult and go to the Ice Cavern. See what it holds. If it's the actual Ice Cavern, sure, we can do that. I would prefer the fire temple or water temple because whoops we have the keys for both so that would that would be that would be ideal that would be ideal if it was either one of those maybe fire temple are there more chests and like more checks to do in the fire temple I don't know. I actually don't know that, but it's all right. We're, yeah, let's head. Let's head back. Become an adult, and then we'll come right back. There's that beehive we gotta get that's above uh, King Zora, and Ice Cavern entrance. See where that takes us. Dun, dun. I know. I know. I know been in danger for quite quite a while now I think quite frankly we're all just used to it so chill out oh yeah Gerudo Valley okay number one this song slaps number two I really really want to find the long shot or um, Epona's song that opens uh, Epona's song especially opens up a ton Pona song allows us to do the cow checks and for cow sanity and um, obviously have Epona so we can ride across uh, the bridge, jump across the bridge. Although the, the long shot, the hook shot is not, it, like the long shot's so much better than the hook shot. The hook shot is just like kind of wimpus, super wimpus when you like, when you upgrade to the long shot, you're like, whoa, <laughs> I'm like not able to do anything with the hook shot. Um, but yeah, I'd prefer a bonus song because that does that frog check. I'm not gonna forget about the frogs now. Not this time. No, <laughs> nope. Um, and then also, yeah, Gerudo Valley. 
and the race against Ingo. Um, yeah, Epona's song does a lot for us. Maybe one of these days. I have a hard time believing that it's not in the logic. Or that it's not, um, that's not, that it's not not in the way of the hero. You know what I mean? That it's not not a part of the thing. You know what I mean? I'm pretty sure, pretty sure we gotta do it. We need it. Where am I going again? Oh yeah, Zor's Domain. <laughs> I just got blabbing on. I was like, where am I going? Where are we? Who am I? Oh, that was weird. I'm pretty sure fly. I, it was a fly. It was something. Something like flew in front of my face and like that was weird. Made me go like cross-eyed for a second. I was like, what the heck was that? It freaked me out a little bit. I'm using a... So I... Um, I have... I've had a pop filter for a while now. I hope that it's... That it actually is effective. Because I've noticed that... Sorry, I'm kind of adjusting it right now. So if you're hearing like a... Like a creaky weird noise that's that's me touching it but but i hope it's working like like pop popcorn is it working are the peas really kind of like cringy to hear or does it actually work i guess i will find out as i get it but yeah i'm hoping it's working um i've had it for a while I just i it to be honest like it's it it's uh, a part of a different setup that I'm hoping to, like, transition to in the future. Um, my current setup, like, this pop filter, I just didn't really know how to, like, set it up with it. It's just, like, the the attachment that how it hooks onto stuff. But I pretty much just jimmy-rigged it to <laughs> to kind of work out for me. So, uh, yeah, so, you know. You know, so no more, no more peas that just pop in your ears and smack the old eardrums around and make you say, this sucks. I hope you haven't said this sucks. Sometimes I say this sucks in terms of like randomizer, like, what am I doing? Can't find anything. This sucks. Am I sound? I hope, I hope it's not like nails on a chalkboard with the peas. Hope the peas are better. Eat your peas, okay? Your veggies, need them. All right, I'm I'm done talking about about it. I'm, I'm just done. I'm done. I'm done. Let's, let's be done. Okay. Oh man, I wish we had like more warp songs and more warps to anywhere but Death Mountain Crater of all places. Ugh. All right. Is the hive still here as an adult? It is not. That sucks. See again, I said this sucks. This sucks. This looks like we need boomerang for that one as a kid. But we could still do this. Oh, I should have just put the, the hover boots. Hover boots. The hover botas. Isn't that boots in Spanish? Botas? I think. I don't know. I could be way wrong. Okay, whatever. You know what? I'm just going to go back. I'm just going to go back to where Frozen Jabu Jabu is. Like, what's th what's the deal? Is Jabu Jabu, like, just gone? Oh, gosh. I did not mean to do that. Is Jabu just gone? Or... Oh, my... Okay. Yeah, that's my question. Is Jabu gone? Or is this like his remains and it's like frozen over? He's killed. I mean, Jabu's bigger than that ice pile. Oh, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Okay, you know what? Combine slippery hover boots with slippery ice. Yeah, it's going to be a pain. So let's just do this the old-fashioned way and not be stupid. Jump. Jump. Oh my gosh, whatever. I'm going to do this shortcut. Come on, let me climb. Dip down, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. What are you? What are you? Fire temple, water temple, what? Fire, te fire temple, here we are. Okay, so the frustrating thing about this is we need to have... Wait, what's the music? 
Oh, it's talking to the great Deku Tree. 